Hey everybody, welcome to the Chaos Factory. I wanted to show you guys some uh, improvised shape charges that I've been working on. Um, this one right here I think is going to be the most uh, successful. Um, you can see we got a metal exterior can. Um, there's where our fuse will be entered in. Um, if you, you can see that the tip of the cone is uh, pretty much where we need it to be in the center. And um, we got a um, not really an optimized uh, cone because of the sheet metal and the fact that it has a seam and it's soldered. Um, but it is at an optimal angle. And um, so what we'll do is fill this in with, um, I'll use a Anmol mix and try to get it really uh, powderized to, um, so it acts more like a, a plastic explosive so i feel every spot every nook and cranny it's soldered on here it actually is also uh, I, don't, I don't know if you can see it but there's epoxy an epoxy seal industrial strength epoxy um, then i'll have this epoxy then the detonator will be centered right above the um, apex of that cone just like the um, russian um, shape charge for their RPG is kind of uh, shaped. If you look at the diagrams, the detonator is usually centered right above the tip right there, either touching it almost or just offset a little bit. And then this one right here is, um, was utilized a little bottle, put a different angle on it. This is actually real thick aluminum, like the aluminum from the bottom of a, a soda can. Um, you know, cut out and then uh, shaped into a cone. There is a seam on it. Uh, I wasn't able to uh, solder this because of the aluminum, but I was able to uh, epoxy it really well. And uh, so we have that one we're going to try out too. Um, I'll try all these probably today or this evening and uh, uh, post the results either tonight or tomorrow morning. Uh, just wanted to show you all what I was working on. Um, I do want to give a shout out to Joe Dierte. He's one of my biggest fans. I wanted to mention him. Um, but everybody have a good new year and thanks for watching. All right.